And I just, I just met a beautiful family over there. Did you? Yeah, from Linden. Perfect family. From Linden. Yeah, good looking husband, good looking wife, yeah. two beautiful kids. Yeah. Check your hair back, boy. Yeah. Wish I had all that, but look at me. Hi, good, how are you? Man. You got a wonderful son. In case you forgot, yeah, that's what he says back here. Yeah, how about those Edmonton Oilers? Yeah. How about the Edmonton Oilers? Yeah, get her strapped on, boys. How about those Calgary Flames? How about the Florida Panthers that took Calgary's best player? <laughs> Okay, how are we lining them up, Austin? Just the way they're wrote down? No? Okay. All right, be a couple minutes. Hey, Dan. You're going to give the buckle to Lonnie? Yep. Hey, Dan. Okay, we're going to do a presentation here. We're going to do the presentation for a winner of our BRC. Bull riding here. We're going to go to Lonnie Phillips. They got the, where is Lonnie? Yeah. Yeah, come on out, Lonnie. Come and get your buckle. Sponsored by the Vic Vanderloo Memorial Buckler. Sponsored by Bruce and Shannon Vanderloo. I want to thank them. They've been doing it for many, many years. The Vanderloo, yeah. You guys getting, you getting good pictures over there? Smile for the camera, Lonnie. Hey, yeah, way over there, Lonnie. They they got that extra, Smile. extra zoom in lens. Hey, there. Lonnie, can you see me over here? Yeah. Can you guys face this way over here for this lady and smile? Yeah. Thank you. Not a boy. Right. Yeah. Did you get him, Heather? Did you zoom right in on him? All right. Everybody could see him on the big screen. Is he smiling big time? That kid's always smiling. Yeah. Do you see the mustache on that boy? <laughs> He's kind of like that. Uh, what's that one down in the states there? Hot sauce, Camas, or whatever. Did he have a handlebar? Hey, hey, Dan. I need you. Sewell, I need you to make a presidential decision right now. And don't mess this up like Beasley did all the time, okay? This little girl, April, she doesn't want to be in the keg race. Now, can we please all these people and put me in the keg race tomorrow on her horse? Stick horse. I don't need to win the money, but can I take her place? Sure, he says sure. All right, April, we're on. Can you hold that? I can use your horse? I'm not going to lie to you. I've never been on a horse before. <laughs> Colton. Colton Webb, you're wanted at the shoot. Colton Webb. We're going to see how this turns Dougie. out tomorrow. Dougie, where's Dougie? Yeah. Man, I can't believe I'm entering the keg race. Where's Dougie Webb? You got him? Starting with Blake Baylog. All right, here's Blake Baylog on Ron Burgundy. Hey, is this is this the vet? This is the vet. Yeah. Oh boy. Okay, Ron Burgundy in the vet. Sired, uh, sired by night and damned by everybody, I guess, eh? Uh, I can't believe how excited I am to really be in the keg race tomorrow. Yeah. You're, you always like the keg race. I, yeah, for those of you that know me, I love that event. Yeah. I just didn't want to go in it when the Musgrove girls were in. They scared me. Okay. Now this would be appropriate if a Baylog rode a Hereford. Because the Baylogs are big in the Hereford business down there in Lethbridge. He's probably a cousin to him, I would think. You think he's nervous right now or just downright scared? I don't know. I guess I'm gonna say scared. Uh. All right, they're getting them all tied in there. They're doing, they're using the same equipment. Got the flank on the bull, they're pulling up the bull, putting his hands in. Now, do they have to ride him with one or can they have the option to ride him two? One I hand, hope. one hand, two hands. I hope they're riding with one hand. Yeah. All right, looks like he's got his hand in there, sliding up on the rope.
<laughs> oh. Oh, how was that, Blake? Old Ron Burgundy took you out there for a trip, didn't he? Yeah. Come on, old bull. And do you know my luck? If I got on that bull tomorrow, he'd buck out of his yang and I'd land in the third row over there. <laughs> Just about made me want to ride one. Yeah. You gotta look at it, Take a deep breath. <laughs> <laughs> 36 and 36, 72. 72 points for Blake, 72. All right, we're going with Al Pitch. We're going with Dougie. Oh, here, $2,800 by Stephen Old Trucking. Come on, Dougie. This is Dougie, right? This is the guy we pumped up, rode 300 bulls, never been on one. This is the guy, you betcha. Who, like bought, said, who, who bought him? Stephen O. Trucking. Right there? Yeah. Well, I got two things to say to you, sir. Thank you, and I'm sorry. Because yeah. <laughs> Dougie's been doing some socializing in the back. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe even might have been around the dead stunk for a while. We're not yeah. sure. <laughs> <laughs> come on, Dougie. Oh, has he still got his leotards on? All right, come on, come on Dougie. Dougie. Oh. oh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, he didn't ride him long enough for his spandex to become up into a speedo. All right, Dougie. Oh. Still appreciate you coming out. Yes. Good, I'm having a hard time even looking over the direction of the guy that bit on him. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know it's all for a good cause, and we do appreciate that. Yes, sir. I'm not going to look you in the eye, but thank Going you. To Mike I Romans. It. Mike Romans is our next man up on Oompa Loompa. Coming out of the Bow Slope Shipping Association. Oompa Loompa. Who bid on this one? We got... This is your Canadian Heat. Uh, oh yeah, this guy went pretty high too, didn't he? $1,700. Oh yeah, no, not too high. No. But that's high enough, we appreciate it. Thank that you. Was, that was second highest. Yeah. That was second highest, yeah. Oh, so, I, I'm i sorry, sir, I really, yeah. man, 17 to what, what did, what did the other guy pay, 29? 28, 1,700, 1,250, 1,200, 500, and 1,000 is what they were all bid on. I don't know how you feel, but I feel sick to my stomach right now if I lost that money. But you know, it's all to a good cause. It definitely is. Yes. Doesn't mean I wouldn't be sick to my stomach. <laughs> you have no idea of my financial situation. Well, you haven't. It's, it's, you're not here Sunday yet, and you haven't picked up your check. So it's okay. I'm gonna win the K race tomorrow. You're gonna win the K race? Yes, sir. All right. Hey, April. Oh crap! Mike Roman's Oopa Loopa. Oh yeah, big smile. Anyway. Hey, April. Uh, he says, I'm used to coming out of the Synergy. What kind of horse am I riding tomorrow? Like a Hereford, Brammer? What am I getting on? A quarter horse. Like, I know nothing about horses, but like, I know how many hands high. The biggest thing is just keep seven. Do not say over 15, please. 15, two. That's bad enough. I'm scared. <laughs> 15, two hands high. Al Pitch. All right, riding for dry shot. Riding for dry shot. If you got, you know, them good old dry shot winter boots. Al Pitch on Schmoosh. 
Blacker. Whoosh. Whoosh. Yeah. That's what just happened to that poor guy. Whoosh. Okay, bear down. Get her done, Al. Get her done. Oh, pretty good try, Mo. Ah, boy. Good ride, Al. Two. Two. Yep.